So, Usher Raymond's stalker wife, Darshell Jones Raymond, yes, Raymond, R -A -Y -M -O -N -D. is planning to sue him for $80 million. In a recent letter, this is what she had to say. I would like to file a lawsuit against Usher Raymond for, for $80 million for libel, slandering my name, ruining my reputation, and defamation of character, including pain and suffering in relation to wrongful incarceration. I had no ill intent when I was outside and across the street from the recording studio. I just wanted to acquire a quote for myself to complete my assignment for Usher's master class in which I was a student. Huh? Well, let's rewind. This woman has a long history with Usher, where she stalks him at his shows, she does online stalking, even showed up to his studio, obviously, and his home, yes. She showed up to his Atlanta home several times. Mind you, his home is in a gated community, has security, and she was letting inside of it in 2012 and it wasn't until Usher's people realized that nobody knew her and he ended up calling the police because she kept coming back. So she was taken away for a mental evaluation. And since then, Usher has had to get over three restraining orders for her. Child, look, I don't make these things up. Anyway, upon further investigation and going through her social media, we realized that this woman is either batshit crazy or Usher has a lot of skeletons in his closet. I mean, even after all the legal proceedings, she continues to post about Usher every chance she gets. I'm talking about Usher is literally 85% of her Instagram page. I mean, her whole life revolves around him. And she really, really believes that she was once with this man. And honestly, I would have thought it was automatically bullshit, but on the contrary, if you think about it, how did she get into this man's house? Why was she actually let in by his people? I mean, she claims that Usher even called her personally. How did he get her number? Why is her last name Raymond? There's a whole lot of pieces missing to this puzzle, but by now we all know that Usher is a liar and a cheater. And he doesn't necessarily have a type from what we've been seeing, so what if this woman ain't that crazy? I don't know, just plain devil's advocate. I received a call from Mr. Raymond stating that he wanted to see me and also that he stated the time that he called in his voicemail. I have archived them in the phone. Mr. Raymond has um, apparently trespassed me and tried to charge me with criminal trespassing out in Johns Creek, Georgia with his property. I am assuming that when he calls me, he expects me to answer his call and it doesn't matter how I get to him. That is the reason why I showed up at his property. Yesterday, when I was leaving, trying to uh, reply to his call, I was going to a broker to apply for a job and I was served with stocking papers and I'm going to list those right now. This is Mr. Reynolds uh, paperwork that he filed on me with the Superior Court of Fulton County in the state of Georgia. Mr. Raymond also signed this. I would like to make aware for my own purposes that for the last year, at least since February 2011, me and Mr. Raymond have been exchanging finances through Western Union and through Bank of America. One person under the name of James Hall. I am not a stalker. I have been an advocate for Mr. Raymond and his family. He has been complaining constantly to me about his ankle pains, his headaches, and his situation with obtaining custody of his children. Now, I am put in the position to where I'm told I cannot follow him um, through emails, through Facebook, or Twitter. That means also iTunes. So if Mr. Raymond comes out with new music, he has to be aware that I cannot spend my money with him because he has officially slandered me 
and defamed my character. Me and Mr. Raymond had um, binding agreements to where he was supposed to make the living arrangements for me. That is why the finances were being funded to him. And also, he would help me in the music career. I have no other reasons to contact Mr. Raymond, and he knows that. Um, I am in love with Mr. Raymond, but I do not appreciate the fact that he has tried to charge me with stalking. If he has charged me with that, that does mean that he has um, considerably defamed my character and slandered me. All in all, she is trying to sue him for $80 million for completely ruining her image. $80 million though? At this point, all of Usher's cases is a joke. What do y'all think? Leave your thoughts below and don't forget to like, share, subscribe, follow us at facebook.com, and don't forget to hit that bell to join the notification gang. Pettyblog.com signing off.